how to add your business to Google Maps. That means your business address, your restaurant, hotel, your office, consultancy firm, or whatever you have, you want to put on the Google Maps so that your target customer or your clients can find you out on the Google Maps so that they can find your location easily and can use the Google Map to find you out. So at the very beginning, we will go to Google Map. Google Maps. If we click to the Google Map, remember you must sign in with your Gmail ID. So if your Gmail ID you know that's better or you can create, you, we come to the Google Map. On this menu button, if we click there, you will find some options. Then this option, your places. So if you click to the your places, then you can also put your residence address and your work. So if you, it is your office or your restaurant or business location, then it's work. If you click here, this is my address. It's called Vian Comercio. It's in Italy. So this is here. This is my address. If you don't find, you should write down here exactly your address, your state name, number, postcode, and city name. So this is my one where I am going to put it now. This is, you can check it out again. It's called Vian Comercio 66. Add your business. Click to the add your business. Start building your business profile. So, what is your business name? I'm going to write down my business name. This is DG Mobile. I have an, I have an agency from DG Mobile. So, create a business with this name click it's a category so my business category is telecommunication it's a same mobile company telecommunication telephone company okay so telephone company there is also telecommunication i think telecommunication could be the better one telecommunication school no telecommunication engineer television station telephone access telephone company this telephone company then you should find it out what category you have. So next, do you want to add a location customers can visit like a store or office? Yes, it means you target customer can visit you on the location where you are going to set it down. So yes, the next, what's the address? They are exactly asking you again the address. So it's Italy. You will find write down your country name, which country you are. Street. I'm going to write down. Okay. There is also if you it is very long, you can click here, add line, another line. It's postal code. It's your postcode, your local postcode number, city name, my city name. I have written province, which province you are. My one is Rome, Italy. In local name, it's called Roma. Then next. Do you also serve customers outside of the location? It means if you are serving your business service outside of this location, if it is yes, you can yes. If it is no, so in my case, it's not because I will provide only the service in my agency so next what contact details do you want to show that to a customer so you can put here so customer will find you on the google map or google location or in the google so they can call you they can ask you for some information you can write down your office number or your personal number whatever you like so i will write down my office number it's called zero six nine two zero four three 481. This is my landline number. If you have your website 
address you can put it so i don't have now website get a free website if there is a promotion for the for the google so i don't need it now if you like you can choose this option the next remember you select the code number of your country before making the phone number so you have been verified you can manage digimobile on google using best way fhuar this is my email address what i before told you log in with your email address so this email address i can modify even this location or information about my business opening hour closing hour everything you can put down so next click the next so this is your business hour what time you are open what time you are closed which day is your holiday so sunday is closed no i open every day every day open click the every day so opening hours open set my one is open at 9 30 9 30 a.m and closes at i close at 1 p.m 1 and 30 p.m then reopen at i open it again four o'clock i mean 4 p.m then i close it at 8 8 p.m it's 8 8 p.m this way you can choose every day how you like okay the same schedule for monday monday 9 30 close at 1 30 no, 1 30 pm then reopen at 4 pm and close okay when you have set it down if your business hours or if you can customize it then go next add messaging if you want to add some messages of op messaging options accept messages you can do for this now i just skip it and add business description so here you can write down some descriptions of your business activity or categories what you are doing so i just simply write down the dg mobile mobile or i just simply write down the dg mobile official official store that's it next so add your photos to your business add photos if you can click down here and you can uh, upload some photos internal or external some photos or your product photos if you have a store super store or retail store or grocery store whatever it is related your activity you can post the some photos i just cancel it now let's keep there is a promotion from google if you want to promote your this address and your business advertising so I just skip it. Your business profile is almost ready. To continue. After continue, then this is all done. And overall, nothing more. So in the meantime, uh, after some days, after reviewing from the Google location, Google already, you can see your this name on the Google business location. So you can find it on the Google. If you simply write down the Google, that's DG Mobile near me. Near me. I just for a demo. DG Mobile look this name. This these are the already they approved it. So my one is not approved yet. So if it is, then I can see it on my CD Fee machine. Look, in Fee machine there is no one else. No one's yet. So my one will be the first one because I'm the only one official retailer store in my city. Uh, remember, after some days, you may receive a letter with some code number so that to approve to approve your location, if it is right or wrong, they will send you a card with the Google name to your post post box, and you can simply just visit the address where it is written business.google.com then of course you must log in with your gmail this gmail 
account gmail id so if you approve it then all done sometimes they send you the card and with a code number okay hope you will enjoy it if you are benefited that's my work is successful thank you so much hope see you in another video bye